Hey team, it's Dr. George here reporting in from Corona Town. So I just wanted to give an update on important things for protecting yourself during these times. Nothing really from the messaging perspective has changed. Keep on washing your hands. 20 seconds of soap on your hands will make the virus dead. So wash your hands frequently. If you don't have access to soap, you can use the alcohol-based things. Don't touch your face without washing your hands. If you have to use extreme measures, so be it. Anytime your hand is heading towards your face, please be sure to absolutely wash your hands. If you have a cough, very, very important cough into your elbow, the cool kids may want to add in a bit of a dab as well. Now, the dab is actually a useful thing because it helps remind us to keep one to two meters away from people who are coughing. So if you have a cough, either turn towards a wall or get away from people before you cough because we know that the little droplets can be passed around about one to two meters. So it's important to turn away from people when you're coughing and cough into your elbow cool kids may want to do a dab. Now we know the virus can live on surfaces for up to nine days so it is very very important keep on cleaning your surfaces and your phone. Clean your darn phone. That's one of the filthiest things you can be carrying around so give it a wipe as well. Um, of course if you're feeling unwell stay at home. Avoid crowds. Avoid other people. Stay at home. Phone your doctor, phone the local corona service, phone the local health department to get further information on what you need to do. The government is now setting it up so we can have consultations with you over the phone as well. And a final note is just remembering that masks are only useful if you are unwell um, to help prevent that spread of the little droplets as well. But as a prevention measure, they're not very useful please 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 these are actually very difficult to get at the moment um, because of panic buying and it means that people like myself who need them to be able to do the testing uh, are struggling to get access to that and that's not a woe is me story but it is a point that we just have to be aware that resources are very very limited at the moment and we're trying to keep them protected as much as we can so stay at home if you are unwell. Keeping in mind the symptoms are fevers, sore throat, sore chest, shortness of breath, headache. Um, it can be like a, a, a very, very bad flu. In some people it can be a mild illness as well. So that's why it's important to talk with your doctor if you've had a risk. And the risks are any international travel or contact with a person of a confirmed case of coronavirus. So there you go. That's the updates today from uh, Corona Town. If you have any questions, please drop me a message below. See you guys.